Good morning from Antarctica. Today's day eight in our journey through Antarctica. Every day, they always post the schedule and according to this, we're gonna go to Danko Island in the morning. Look at this, there's a big chunk of ice on the deck. I think they were actually using it for last night's dinner. Why not storing it outside here? Right now, it's 6.40ish and yesterday, around this time, it started to get bright in the sunrise uh, around 6.40. But I completely forgot that yesterday was the uh, fall equinox here in the southern hemisphere. Every day, we actually lose 24 minutes of sunlight. Sunrise is gonna be around 7 something today. But first, we're gonna do the pool plunge, which is gonna be cold. We try to brace ourselves to jump into the cold water. It's supposed to be 0 degrees Celsius out there, but it's gonna be a great and cold morning. Refreshing. <laughs> Refreshing, that's a good word. It's 0 degrees out. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing this, it's just for the experience. And then James and Matthew's already done it yesterday, and I'm so jealous. I don't know why. Let's go, Halif. Yeah. <laughs> got it. it. Go in the. Go fast all at once. Shit. Let's go. Conveniently going next door to the sauna. Just run all the way to the dry sauna, which is you know sort of warm. I'm definitely perked up now. <laughs> this morning we are in a beautiful passage called Tierra Channel. Off of our port side is the Antarctic Peninsula, the continent itself. And off the starboard side is this beautifully mountainous island called Ronje Island. So we're going in between. Thank you do for pictures or movie. Just struggling my way up to the main deck on the sixth floor. Gotta be super careful because it's so slippery. Uh, they're cleaning it up, but other than that, it's like completely ice. The deck is just covered with ice. It's so pretty. Not so much on the sunrise, but at least that's where it is. You can see that little sun rays behind this cloud. We are getting ready for the 9 o'clock excursion to the Danko Islands just right behind us. Such a beautiful morning in Antarctica. It's a beautiful day, spot for whales. If we see whales, we're gonna stay here this afternoon, okay? Here we go. We arrived on Danko Island. So there are several colonies of penguins here on this island. From what we were told, um, there's one colony actually nested on top of this hill. Pretty ambitious little creatures, and we're gonna come to see them up there on the top of the summit. way to go up to the summit and you can actually see all these tracks this is called the penguin highways from the top of the summit all the way back to the ocean and this is actually where the penguins slide to the ocean to hunt for fish and we try to be sensitively responsible not to disturb them it's quite a hike here um, so I'm getting pretty warm it's not 
cold to begin with, around 32 degrees or 0 Celsius, so it's not freezing. Some cool penguins behind me. <laughs> Putting off all those carbs. Oh, no kidding. <laughs> <laughs> good workout. It's a good workout. I couldn't imagine doing this if it wasn't a group of marathoners. But yeah, it's, a, it's quite a hike. Worth it in the end, though. I never imagined that Antarctica would have such huge mountains. It's massive. Snow angel time. Oh, it's a bit hard. <laughs> We made it to the summit of the Denko Island. It's about 180 meters high. Unfortunately, there's no Starbucks up here for any hot coffee. <laughs> it's a bit cold, but it's pretty cool scenery. It's just on an island, and we're just surrounded by tall mountains. Yeah, and it's basically a mountain that is an island. Mount Denko. Denko Island. It's a colony of penguins are on the beach, and we're gonna hang out with them. All right, let's go. Can we slide down one of those penguin slides? Yes. Okay, let's do it. No. Oh, it's coming to you. Hey buddy, come on there, come on down, that's right, you don't have to be scared, hey, okay. That's my first time I've ever seen an avalanche. Did you get it on camera? I didn't get the initial part, but I got the snowy thing. Clouds. Clouds. getting very slippery as more and more people walking up the mountain so you have to be very careful and it's getting colder now the wind start picking up and it start turning into gray just keep going we're not gonna bother you and all the uh, snowballs on the beach. I particularly love this one. It looks like a crystal ball. Look. But you can see how dense it is. It's probably like millions of years in the making. I'm not gonna lick it. <laughs> Maybe. It's not salty. <laughs> <laughs> an excursion. It is cold, but I really had a good day. Yeah, my fingers are starting to get a bit cold right now. I think I'm going to go back to the ship, but just sitting on the beach here and the penguins, if you sit still enough, they will just come right up to you. Another beautiful day in Antarctica. <laughs> Special today, we got mussels and some kind of duck, maybe, but we definitely hungry before our second excursion this afternoon. Pretty cool. It's pretty close too, it's about 20 feet. Oh, three meters. Yeah. 20 meters. This is uh, killing my knees. <laughs>
We are looking at a leopard seal. These things are massive. That's a big seal. Give us a smile. Yep, the ones that eat anything. <laughs> I bet they can just move through the water, can't they? Yeah, I'm not going to complain about that, even though I got a little bit of water on the lens there. Such a treat. Such a great set though. Oh my god, that's just made my day. It's going to go to the uh, Ocean Knights. Ocean Knights. They're a scientific organization, and what they do is fundamentally they count penguins. We will usually host at least two on every voyage. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! We got 25, so what do we got there? We got 25, 100 here, and we got 100 here. 200! We got 200 over here. Just try to guess on certain sizes of items. A southern right whale penis. Oh, oh no. it's no. a right. right. Yeah, that's it. Right. Right. It's five, oh. five meters. Yeah. Yeah. And we actually won. <laughs> Team Titanic won. Yeah. But anyway, so I'm about to go to bed, but you know, I don't know whether you can tell. But we start going back towards the Drake Passage. So you can actually see that maybe swing side by side and start getting pretty wide movement here on the boat. So that's why I put on my motion sickness patches and hopefully I won't get sick. So tomorrow's gonna be the day at the sea. It'll be fun, still gonna be an experience. And thanks for watching. But first, we're gonna do the pool plunge first. But first, we're gonna do the pool plunge. Shit, it wasn't recording. <laughs> It was not recording the whole time.